Hello, making a short video of the Singer 99 made in 1954. It'll be posted on YouTube for this uh, listing on eBay. It's a, a very nice uh, machine in very good condition. Has some, uh, some nice updates and it works real well. Comes with uh, everything you see here, including the original uh, foot pedal uh, from Singer, uh, the manual, uh, screwdriver, some other attachments, three bobbins, and then one in the machine. Um, and the most importantly, the machine works. I sewed just a few minutes ago on two layers of denim here. That's the front, the back, and then I sewed on this fabric. You can see uh, the front with different stitch lengths than the back. Uh, actually, ran out of bobbin thread in one color, so I had to switch to the other. But, so very nice machine that works uh, works very well. So give you some close-ups on it and talk to you about it as I do that. It's been uh, very well oiled and cleaned and polished. You can see there's a good bit of uh, gloss on the uh, on the bed plate and all over the machine. Uh, the light works. So the new uh, light bulb that I put in there. The uh, bobbin winder feature works. That locks in and locks out. It's a new bobbin winder tire. Uh, the motor belt is new. The power cord uh, is new as well. The rest of the wiring, like the wiring for the light and the foot pedal and the motor are the original, uh, but they're in, in good working condition. So I'm trying to show you different views. Made in 1954, made in uh, Great Britain, as you can see there. There is some wear here and there on it. There are some chips and uh, you'll see some scratches uh, there. There's a chip right there in the center. But for its age, it's in a really remarkably good condition. Like I said, it was cleaned and oiled. So uh, the pictures will show the other side a little bit better than I can do via video. Um, but next I'll show you some videos of me sewing on it. All right, I had to change uh, the bobbin thread, so I'm back and I'll sew up one way, turn around and sew back the other way. This is the longer stitch length. All right, I'll turn around and go back the other way. All right, this is the uh, shorter stitch length. I'll make that change real quick. All right, a little shorter still. There you go. Focus it so you can see. back change the stitch length 